Hey there, everyone. This is Al Cal playing a video game of some kind. Uh, some people call dog game. That's me. I'm the one that's been calling this game this way all this time. We've done all the levels. Like, the levels end here, and then here's the boss, and then it's back to the park. And, I mean, as of now, even though one of the bosses killed me and whatnot, none of the bosses took a whole lot of time. But maybe it'll be different for the finale. <laughs> That foul little scrapper has made it all the way here, to the heart of my toy factory. Boy, she sure likes to hear herself talk. <laughs> but your canine karma has come to an end. My new super glue cannon will be your demise. Evolve, turn on the super glue pump. <laughs> Her jacket is a ghost. That sounds like trouble. We better do what Fluffy said and disable her computers as fast as possible. Do you have a concept for what a computer is? Okay, so there's a solid force there stopping me from getting there. Alright, for some reason this zap box was lowered, so probably relevant to my interest, I would guess. It's been like around here. Yeah, check it out. And then, okay then. Or, or am I supposed to shoot the lower things, I wonder? Like, interestingly, I got shot, but I didn't do anything. Because, like, there's all these popes, right? And, you know, that probably means something. Alright. I couldn't really tell where it lowered. Where is it? Zap? I don't know. Just, there's a stake. It's not quite a zap. Very similar function. Okay, I hit that, and then that made the screw go all wiggle. Um, okay. So did I do the right thing there or not? I am not sure. Like, I was given my instructions of, uh, oh, there it is. It's like right there. Okay. Of, like, you know, disable computer, but I zapped that and then the root or rules boost boost loose. So, you know, keep that in mind. Uh, uh, Krill, you're supposed to aim where I'm going to be, not where I am right now. You can see, like, they're lowering, which implies that it might be the right thing. I don't know where that is, but I'm going to look for it. Okay, it's over there. There you go. Yeah, I can't... Well, I could swing the camera. It just seems like, like not the smartest thing to do. Yeah, they're lowering. Oh, they have the health bar. All right. Like, so why, who keeps lowering these in? Like, just, that, that is the, the main error in terms of um, tactics I feel like you're doing right now. Like, other than that and leading your shots, like, come on. Yeah, but that blows up and then, and then this happens, it's really silly. Somewhere there's a crate and it's a zap and it's swirling around in circles. I found it immediately. It was entirely luck. And then I get shot off my thing. Oh boy. So I'm seeing that bar lower, but does that progress from run to run? I think it is. Okay, no, 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 yeah. There's a, there's a meter on the top left, which I was not looking at for some reason. Yeah, that makes it very clear that I'm doing uh, the right thing here. All right. Whoa! Speed up. Is going here. Yeah, there's less boxes to render, so it's allowed to go faster. That's how it works. That's just sheer simple engineering. All right, I busted all the computer, and that makes the. What is that foul canine up to? Good question. No matter. It is about to become a plush toy. All right. So now we got Zappo Ball that kind of slinks up. Okay, we still got the zap cannons to do our bidding. Sounds great. Looking forward to doing something I have no... Okay, I probably want to destroy that. Yeah, there's going to be six of them. And uh, that's one of them gone. Got it! I don't know how I feel how it's like they didn't know how to make this a proper boss with boss mechanics. So it's like we're going to make it a shooter. Like, sure, like, yeah, I guess, in a way, the dog we use is, like, maybe too strong in a, in, a, in a strange sense, like, you know? Like, barking has a really huge cone of effect, and, like, that's kind of unwieldy, so maybe that's a little bit of what happened, I don't know. I don't know 
why they felt like the way to go was to make guns constantly spawn in. But hey, it's different. I'll take it. There he is. Okay, it doesn't take all that many bullets to die. I will say, it is quite fragile. I mean, you know, it's high deck. It's probably still just a prototype. That's just what these things do. It has, like, a little eyeball. It's pretty cute. I'm not sure how you don't get destroyed, though. Like, am I supposed to just kind of have all my dreams crushed and move on to a different gun every time? Like, is there a way that I can defend from having been obliterated within seconds constantly? The answer is probably. I don't know if there's something you can do to stop her from shooting me. Well, maybe don't put them right in my face. Uh, 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 I have a bad feeling about this. Yeah, you should probably like abort your plan and like not stay on that platform with loose springs. But we got a new Space Edge gizmo that is bringing us pain. Big ol' orb, it flashes lightning and float is there on a plane. Oh, look at that, they're all out. And they all got, they're all going out. Like, so, like, that got, like, immediately hit by something. And I was forced out of my seat. That is just what happens. All right, so you're gone. Oh. Doink. Gonna fall right into super glue. Oh, she did. Sticker! Jam dance! I guess I'll save. Did I beat the game? <laughs> that was... Somehow... Managed to still be really abrupt. Like, it doesn't really so much end as it's... Yeah! I don't know. Okay, she fell. Her poor jacket. Whoa! That was real barks. It wasn't Frankie Muniz barking in a microphone. What did he say? Baba Baba Butch? Even though she's gone, I can still okay. smell the scent of that Cruella woman. Talking aggressively it's sideways to your children. Don't worry, Dotty. All our puppies are safe. And the police will make sure that evil woman won't bother us again for a long, long time. No, really, this is now super awkward. Go. Do those models only exist, well, mate, like, in that angle? an opportune time to make ourselves scarce. Where? I despise traditional prison apparel. I hear someone coming. Let's hide. I recognize this place. I wonder what ever happened to Corella and her henchmen. Yeah, me too. Was she, isn't she like Corbinitely frozen? How long will the gloop keep us like this? I guess her head was never covered. Approximately 20 years, my sweet. Oh, sweet. Not quite as long as our prison sentences. No! <laughs> Yeah, see, because their head weren't covered, so that's why they didn't die. Look at that! FedEx lost this package. Is it safe to come out? He oh, says, coming sure out. Long trip. Sacre bleu! Boy, I sure hope one of you brought sunscreen. I wonder how that happened. Like, I mean, yeah, sometimes packages get lost, but those are pretty big crates. That's a pretty small island. Maybe that was a destination they put and they didn't think about it. I beat the game! Whoa, look at that dance! Yeah, what a strength. Like, the boss was fine. It just didn't feel like the last boss, other than the fact that there was, like, three phases to it. It was fine. It was just odd. It's kind of funny that turns out that one like bubble mini game that led to booms was the, the the practice for the final boss. Whoa, Chickup's blaster right here. This 
this game was honestly I'm gonna I'm gonna be real. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be honest using harsh language. This game was better than what I thought it was going to be. Um Remember that episode one, like I sort of had this uh, thesis about exploring someone else's nostalgia. A game that a lot of people have a lot of nostalgia for that I had no connection with. It's a licensed game for like, you know, not like the major IP of an entertainment company. What, what are you gonna end up with that, you know? I was kind of expecting, I don't know what I was expecting. I was expecting something you know, mid-range, like an oven. But no, this game, like, 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 just taking this as it is, I thought had a lot of very interesting ideas going on. Like, I cannot deny that it is a game that was built with a younger target audience. And I feel like that shows in terms of uh, the difficulty. Like, like, I praise the game for not being punishing, but the reality is it's probably not punishing because it's for kids, you know? Which is unfortunate, but I mean, I mean, that's just how games are at the time. Nowadays, a lot, a lot, a lot of games out there understand the value of not punishing for the sake of it. But, you know, the, God, the game didn't shy away from having, like, genuine platforming segments. And, you know, having sometimes hard things to figure out or to find. I, I'm glad for that. Like, honestly, they did a pretty, pretty decent job. Like, given what they were given, it's nice to see that they didn't just took the easy paycheck, but Toys for Bob actually tried to do something. And I think it works. Because, as I said at the start of this project, Look this game up online, and you get a lot of people who reminisce about this game and have a lot of praise for it. I can totally see why. It makes sense. These are logos! I did it, I beat the game. But I also unlocked the last mini game, which is, you know, a bit awkward. But we're gonna... I'm gonna load my game. That's right, I'm gonna access the memory card 100%. The dog's got a green color. That's because he's sick. No, no, that's sad. What are the stickers like? That's not a sticker. That's a loading screen. You're speaking lies to me. Here we go! That's what it looked like. Uh, okay. Oh. So, pressing any buttons at all beyond left or right is not doing... Oh, now it's working. Oh, that's if I go back. Okay, so... These are things, look at that, they are scenes. It really feels like I'm supposed to select. Oh, no. Continue. But like, I'm pressing anything at all. Like, I keep seeing stickers awarded. You sort of have this, uh, options. This, all this is fine. Uh, great. I switched to analog mode somehow. It really feels like you're supposed to, like, access these, but... Every motion... Oh, now I can use the joystick, by the way. That's what I hadn't done! God damn it. Nonetheless, yeah, like... Oh, or did we unlock parts of them and they kind of united to make the complete pictures that we can see now? I don't know. Like, I'd love to interact with this more, but I I can't. I'm, I pressed every button that I could. Maybe I forgot how controllers work. It's not impossible. Maybe I should have taken a look before having full completion. But anyway, we got jam dance. Let's dance a jam. Just pour all that jam in a big barrel. Exist around it. All right, give me instructions. Hey, check this out. No. My brother okay. Domino and I that found was, this cool that secret was aggressive. sound lab. I think it belongs to Professor Farsboom. The neat thing about all this weird equipment is that the more Domino moves around, the more sound and music the machines make. Okay. I don't think there's a right or wrong way to play around in here. But it sure is fun! Alright, so it's more like a toy than a, a game then. I can see through your head, Frankie! 
What are you gonna do about that? Yeah? Okay, so... Pressing... Oh. So different... So pressing different buttons causes different things to trigger. This is honestly... Like, as far as musical soundboard goes, this is not bad. That's, uh, L1, by the way. Next time! I have no idea. I'm picking a game I know nothing about. <laughs> no one knows about it either, so no one could talk to me about it. Honestly, this is... this is not nothing. There we go.